Why does he have a dirty napkin in his bed? It appears the suspect was jacking off. It's gonna sound like I unlocked something in a video game. I said, it's, it's a procedurally generated detective game. I'm playing Shadows of Doubt. It is a procedurally generated detective game. I think basically you're supposed to solve murders. You can talk to people. There was supposed to be Twitch integration. I don't even know if it's fixed, but I just want to try it out. Honestly, this game seems really fun. So the trickster, this game is kind of, um, I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. We'll see if this game's set for the trickster. All right, fine. We'll, we'll be the trickster. We're doing the widest. We're doing easy. I don't know if you can smoke crack in this game. I, I intend to find out. It's the dead of night. Is this a scary game? Turn on the bedside light. Okay, easy enough. I just can't get used to sleeping without Sam. You can run by holding left shift, crouch by using C, jump using space. Not very athletic. Turn on the light switch. Okay. Light switch in the kitchen. This is my place? Bro, I've got a sick fucking high rise apartment. Are you serious? Pick up. What if I just put my own phone number in this? <laughs> What numbers do we have in here? Uh, telephone number acquired. Okay, wait, I should not be here. I should not be. This is confusing me. Okay, no one answered though. Okay, cool. I'm just gonna hang up. Sorry, we need to, we need to do the tutorial. I'm, I'm messing around. Select the name Oni Johnson. Okay, pin Oni Johnson to your case board using the red pin. Pin the note to your case board using the red pin. Close the board with F. All right, and now Oni Johnson. Who's this Oni Johnson character? Wait, are these actual, actually people's names? Please don't dox me. These are all of our real names. I'm Oni Johnson. Oh, Jay, it's his name's Johnson. Wait, there isn't an Oni. Oh no, it's Johnson is spelled the most fucked up way I've ever seen in my life. Got it, close that. He lives in 802 Rose building. Lovely, let's pin that so we have his address. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Lovely. So now I have one of my viewers. Could you imagine if they had like people's Twitch names and I was just like, yeah. Elibus23. He lives at 203 Rose Build. 802 Rose Building. Keep a lookout for paper clips and hairpins. These can be useful for picking locks. Each lock has its own strength. When you start the process by interacting with the door handle or lock, the indicated bars will tell you how many picks you need to complete a lock pick. You can also use lock picks to sabotage security systems. Wait, what? Aren't I a detective? Why do I have to sabotage security systems? The door handle. Unlock. There we go. Hello. Uh-oh. It looks like you're wandering off. <laughs> he just immediately jumps to his death. And they're like... Looks like you're wandering away from the tutorial area. Oh man, okay. I'm gonna return to the apartment actually is what I decided, guys. I don't like these people in the city. No one's very helpful. Hello. Do you have any spare change? Get out of here. What was the fists button? Oh my God, he's got a knife. <laughs> they're throwing shit. Oh my God. Oh my god, they're aggroed. Okay, hold on. Dude, let me die so I can reset. This is ridiculous. Shit, speaking of guns, did you check the PO box recently? I sent you a cheap 22 so you can protect yourself. Let me know when you get it. No, you didn't, man. Stop. Don't type that. What is wrong with you? Now we're going to go solve this case, okay? I, enough fucking around. I, I'm out of my tomfoolery era, and I'm into my... What would you call this? Dirty napkin. We're taking that. Jesus, this is a trek. Hey. Hey, buddy. Do you know this person? He lives in your building. That's not enough info for me to help you. Okay, well... Do you have any spare change? What's your name? Keep your nose out of my business. I am going to push this guy off the railing. I'll give you money for your name. No, I won't. Have you heard of anything unusual? Nothing. Okay, do you want to provide your fingerprints? Okay, that's fine. Do you have any trigger change? Okay, well, it's good to know. I want to hit him so badly. I want to push him off eight flights of stairs. Okay, it's fine. Everything's fine. Hey, the... Oh, they're drunk. This is perfect. Do you have any spare change? 
<laughs> They're falling down the stairs. They're highly intoxicated. Now's my chance. Do you have any spare change? Please give me $50 right now. It's for an investigation. A box, okay? We're stealing this person's package. <laughs> That's gonna be mine now. Hold on, we, you never know what, you, what you're gonna have to like get into. Once we open this door, there's probably gonna be like a murderer in there. So I, I need to stack up some, some weaponry, you know? these people do what the hell whatever properties is worth checking under the doormat for a key most rooms will feature some kind of ventilation system when struggling to find a safe entrance this could be a great way in huh i swear i had a flashlight maybe i don't okay whatever all right let's check the cadaver shall we let's uh inspect okay so we don't know who this dead guy is that's not good i don't love that let's take his fingerprints okay he died from a bullet wound from low caliber ammunition eight millimeter or something else. Great. Good to know. From examining the body, it appears that the victim has been shot to death. <laughs> you would think so. You know what I mean? He has multiple entry wounds, but I think he died. <laughs> it was actually the cancer that killed him. Unfortunately, it just these bullet wounds are strictly uh, coincidental. These happened after he died. Okay, that's Oni Johnson's. But who is considered the fact that there could be a third killer? Why does he have a dirty napkin in his bed? It appears the suspect was jacking off. Office manager, he works 9 to 17 Monday through Friday. That's good to know. That's very good to know. Check for recent calls by dialing 54100. Is that the same number every time? Last caller was 515. Hmm. He got a call from 515 about an hour before he got murdered. Now that is quite interesting. <laughs> I don't know if there's someone in here. Uh, can I use the shotgun? I don't know how to work a gun in this game. <laughs> I meant to shoot it. I didn't mean to throw the shotgun, you fucking idiot. What the hell are you doing? Why, what, are you, what are you doing throwing a fucking shotgun? Are you stupid? Let's just get the fuck out. <gasps> a bottle. Vodka. I have no open inventory space. We may as well take it, you know? Steal their stuff. As well just kill them. That's actually a fair point, but I didn't really consider that at the time. I just thought it'd be better to steal their stuff. The only combat I've gotten into did not end very well for me, so... Who is to say? Okay, so now what? Let's think this through. What do we know about our suspect? Is the suspect the person that died or the person we're trying to catch? What was his keypad? Fuck, man. He had a note at his house. God damn it. One trillion percent, it's Violet. Oh, hello. You didn't see anything. Let's fucking go. Okay, the name of the citizen is Violet. Confirm. Arrest the killer. Oh, I'm going to. Do you have evidence that places the killer at the crime scene? No. I don't. Where does the killer live? Oh, boy, do I have that. She lives at 1202 Stubbs Avenue. Have you located the murder weapon? No, I have not. All right, we're on our way there now. You're fucking dead to rights as soon as I get there and the fucking swift hammer of justice and the literal hammer that I still have in my inventory from an hour ago meets you, you're going down, Violet. Let's disable all the security measures. Someone is coming to answer the door. Come and answer. Hello. Unknown citizen. Uh, afternoon, what's your name? Mind your own business. I'm Shen Ren. Oh, fuck. I gave him $50 for his name. Shen Ren. Do you know this person? I'm not telling you. Interesting. Can I come and have a look around? Why the hell would I let you in? Because I know that your roommate... Mind your business, eh? Okay, if you want to play hardball... You want to play hardball? That's fine. All good. We can play hardball if you'd like. But I wouldn't recommend it, my friend. <laughs> Just wait for him to leave. And then Fuck, he locked the door. He's a genius. How do we get in? Shen Ren? As soon as he opens the door, I'm giving him the fucking chin music the second this door opens. 
Boom! 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 Oh! 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 Yeah, that's what I fucking thought. Not so fucking tough, are we, you fucking son of a bitch? Huh. Yeah, that's fucking right. Have a seat, my friend. You fucking piece of shit. <laughs> Could you imagine if he's at the wrong apartment? Wait. <laughs> Let me check that address. One more time. <laughs> no, this is the right apartment. Could it be? Wait, this is actually just his stuff. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> Wait a second. I mean, I'm taking his money and his key, but why is this just his stuff? And he do, do, you, do you not have a roommate? Are you serious? Wait, who is Violet? There's just one bed here. Uh oh. Once you've figured out the culprit, you may want to perform a citizen's arrest. <laughs> this will need handcuffs. You can find them in vending machines near City Hall. Once arrested, citizens are much more likely to answer questions. After two hours, handcuffed citizens are not reported as part of the case. Submission will be freed. You'll need to acquire their name and case to recognize... Oh my god. To free a citizen, focus on the handcuffs. You'll get an option to release. Fucking piece of shit. I know you're a criminal. You... I know you fucking murdered those people. Don't lie to me. How about this fucking apple? You like killing people? Is that what it is? Not so tough. Not so tough when the fucking pork's on the line, huh? Oh, this shit's gonna fucking spoil. That's right. Enjoy it. It's all going bad. The synth beef and everything. Vodka? So you're a fucking drunk as well. You make me sick. All right, sorry. I gotta run, guys. I gotta get out of here. We gotta, we gotta get the fuck out. I can't move. I'm moving so slowly. Oh my god, I'm getting blasted. I just have a fucking- there's a fucking giant gun on me. And this guy's got a knife or something. Is this still the tutorial? <laughs> Shut up. She killed him! You suck. You can't even aim that fucking thing. You're terrible. That's fucking right. Give me that gun. Give me that gun, please. So this is just like, just like stuff happens in this universe, even when it's not like illegal. It's kind of cool. There's just like stuff constantly happening. What are these batteries used for? There's a lot of them. Well, I guess I kind of broke in here for nothing. I was kind of looking for money, to be honest with you. And there's seems to be none. It's pretty depressing. Sad life we live, you know? There's been a murder. Pay medical fees. Attempt to escape without paying fees, obviously. It was too easy. <laughs> it was too fucking easy. Bro. If this person fucking woke up from the sound of me walking around. Are they watching TV? You are kidding me. Imagine you just fucking literally wake up. You turn on your light. You wake up in the middle of the night. You go turn on a light. There's just a guy crouched in the corner of your fucking apartment, dude. I have to just beat his ass. I don't have a chance. I forgot to buy more handcuffs. I don't know what to tell you, man. You made a mistake. You fucked up, brother. Oh my god, he's got a gun? I mean, I can try it. We can try a custom generated. Hold on, let me exit. Oh, I didn't save the game. There should really be like a prompt that's like, are you sure you want to quit? You know, I feel like that would be a good feature to add if the devs are, you know, open to it. Oh yeah, it's gone. Okay, sandbox, generate city. The city's name is Poop. 
Is this how fast you're supposed to move? Holy shit, I played this entire game just with a being shot multiple times. All right, time for some Minecraft. There's an 87% chance to hit, so you know, pretty sad. You're fucking literally joking, bro. Good, that was a good run. Nothing to worry about there. <laughs> Nothing to see, let's just move on.